Hello guys and welcome to my first episode of my mini YouTube TV show called Poon's Galaxy Recreates. In today's episode, I'm going to show you how I created this beautiful yellow dashiki into this. Guess that you just know one Another soul is broken It's always kind of funny how You find out how they're coping So he asked me how I'm coping And I So first off you're gonna start off By ripping off the seams off the pockets Then after you're gonna take a skirt Of that fits you And you're going to use it as a pattern So you can create your skirt And you're gonna leave an inch seam allowance in order to sew and the fabric on the original shirt is not that stretchy and you're just going to cut around it then you're going to grab your serger after you're done cutting it and you're going to serge along the edge of the skirt to create your stitch on the side ask them if you know this i said listen boy i'm focused i said me i drink fine and ginger Next, we're going to add a zipper to our skirt in order to so it can go on us perfectly and we can zip it up so it can be nice and fitted. And then, so you're going to see me here cutting out the length of the zipper and folding the, the hem on the zipper in order to have a professional zipper sewed on. And once we're done with that, I'm going to go on my sewing machine and I'm going to sew on the zipper. She have the pine with the ginger, spliff like time, girl I get ginger. Miss right wine, never you linger. Move quick like Jackie Chan ninja. When me in ya, me tell her if you wine, funny, wine, funny, wine, funny thing. Climb for the, climb for the, climb for the king. But I know me, I sing me, I pray she no move from my drink. She has a pine and ginger. Also, when applying your zipper, don't forget to change it into a zipper foot to replace the one you're currently using with the zipper foot so that you may be able to sew on your zipper properly. I guess I'm gonna care about tomorrow. I guess I'm gonna care about tomorrow. I'm off the butter, not a leaf. 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 Put the fire to the split, smoke away for release. I'm off the butter, not a leaf. I'm off the butter, not a leaf. I'm off the butter, not a leaf. Put the fire to the split, smoke away for release. Me out. Now we're going to work on our bralette. So I just took a bralette from one of the bathing suits I made and used it as a pattern and do the same thing here and leave an inch to an, an inch and a half seam allowance on it. And you're going to fold your fabric right side to right side so you have two um, pieces for it to make your bra. Up next, we're going to hem along um, the sides of our bralette in order to give it a professional look. So basically, when you hem it, you just fold it over twice, and then you're going to give it a straight stitch. And don't forget to back stitch at the beginning and at the end of when you're sewing. <laughs> It should look something like this when you're done. Now I went ahead and cut out some straps. I had two straps for the top of the, the bra. And then I had four to connect to make the long string to wrap around me, around my back area. So as you can see, what I did in this video is I folded 
the strap into into half and then I did a straight stitch all the way down and do not forget to back stitch at the beginning and at the end guys then I got a loop turner sorry mine just broken I need to buy another one but it still gets the job done so and then you insert it from the middle and then on the little chip you insert a piece of cloth through it and then you close the, the clamp and then you basically just pull it through and then you there you go after you're done with all that you should have a string yay <laughs> there we go <laughs> once we're done with the string we're gonna go ahead and fold the top of our bra double fold then we're gonna place the string on top of the double fold and do a zigzag stitch twice going back and not not forgetting to backwards and <laughs> Then go ahead and take the end of your string and tie a knot to give that cute little look. And then once you're done tying that knot, we can move to the next step. Everybody's cold. Then we're going to take the end of the bra and we're going to fold in the, the ends, as you can see what I'm doing here. Then we're going to do a slight fold and we're going to do another fold, basically a double fold that will lead to it having a little loop entrance that is able to fit the string that we just created in order to slide through with the loop turner. And then we're going to stitch a straight stitch along the top, not in the middle because we need the string to go through. And then after we're done with that, then we can go ahead and move on to the next step. Guess that you just know one another soul is it should look like this once we're done sewing. Now we're going to go ahead and take our loop turner and do the same process kind of similar to when we're making the string. Insert the loop turner through the hole in the bralette and then clip on the end of the string and pull it through. And then once you have it through, you can just go ahead and finish it up and push it through. And that'll be all. Thank you so much for watching. Like and subscribe. And see you guys next time in my next tutorial. Broken. It's all